sky. These groups of traditional carolers are today a popular tourist attraction. On New Year's Eve, they put on the costumes they have inherited from their predecessors and go caroling from house to house. In Moldavia, in the east and northeast, a similar ritual is known as the bear's dance. Young men dressed in costumes made of bear's skin and accompanied by musicians and drummers walk through every street in the village, striking their whips in the air. People welcome them into their homes and ask them to perform the bear's dance in the gardens as part of a fertility rite. The bear's dance stems from an ancient tradition. The bear was a sacred animal for the Romanian ancestors, the Jato Dacians. A ritual we find all over the country is wishing someone best wishes in the new year while touching them lightly with the sorkovam, a stick adorned with artificial flowers. Women go out into the garden on New Year's Eve, climb on the log used for cutting the firewood and wait until the name of a young man is called out. It is believed she will marry someone bearing this name and coming from the direction where from she hears the name being called out. Superstitions were important for people living in traditional communities. It was believed, for example, that evil spirits were afraid of powerful sounds and light. So people would light big fires on New Year's Eve to drive these spirits away. Also, people would not lock their house doors this evening so as to give a good welcome to the year to come. We now leave you with the reenactment of the traditional little plough ritual. <laughs> Yeah.